house of cards. Let's see. This probably has some juicy details. Ryu Aoki, current governor of Tokyo, age 42. That's even the same age as the young master. Don't freak out. Maybe it's all a coincidence. Hmm. Says Aoki was a shut-in until he was 20. Then he suddenly took off for America. He took political econ courses at Harvard, where he became close friends with Hajime Ogasawara. Then they came back to Japan. You know, I think they founded Bleach Japan that year. Maybe by then he was already making all his shadowy plans. Ugh. Bleach Japan's agenda is hardly shadowy. In fact, it was pretty damn heartwarming for lots of folks. Seeing those youngsters demand decency, and Aoki's popularity skyrocketed. He was on magazine covers, on TV. He was in the public eye every day. Got a gig as a commentator eventually. That's right, and then he entered politics. He left Ogasawara in charge of Bleach Japan. Looks like he didn't win the governor race by a landslide exactly, but now his approval rating is 80%. Plus, he's got no political enemies. Life's good for him. Are there any articles that say he has another name? That's what I want to know. I don't see anything like that. But I still think you're jumping to conclusions. I wouldn't write off what Kasuga's saying, though. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that make perfect sense if it turned out Masato Arakawa is the governor. Y yeah? Like what? Like his sudden gain in political support that I was just talking about. That was all because he destroyed the Tojo clan with his Kamurocho 3K plan. Was that the plan to wipe out all the Yakuza? Yeah. After he rolled it out, the Tojo officers vanished from the city like so much smoke in the wind. Vanished? Yeah. I mean, they probably just fled the city out of panic. They knew they were on the verge of getting busted. The 3K plan enacted a bunch of new anti-Yakuza laws. The cops had a smorgasbord of violations to pick from. They could have booked the whole damn Tojo clan. So yeah, I assume the officers skipped town when they saw the cloud of charges hovering over them. Definitely sounds like they were backed into a corner. Right. Although it wasn't really the 3K plan itself that made them feel trapped. It was more because the Tojo's internal affairs got leaked to the police. And I'd bet my life the guy who leaked it was Masumi Arakawa. Huh? You think the patriarch of the Arakawa family colluded with the governor? Well, if the governor is Masato like Kasuga thinks, then it's all in the family. <laughs> Forget collusion. That's just plain nepotism. Hey, it would also give Arakawa a reason to betray his clan. Well, he was more loyal to his son than he was to the Tojo clan. Most men would be. Most men, yes, but not Arakawa-san. Well, if you say so, but you have to admit, my theory makes sense. Arakawa is human. And what's more human than wanting the best for your child? Parents, even Yakuza parents, will do anything for their kids. <sighs> Is the governor really the young master? If so, how did he do it? One thing I don't get. How did the young master hide his past? A Yakuza can't become governor. Well, maybe he bought a family register. You can just buy one? Yep. Well, it's easier to create a fictional person than you think. Yeah. Doctor up a photo, slap on a false name, and file a fake official register. You can get by on that for a good while. As long as no one takes a deep look at your file, of course. Otherwise, it falls apart real quick. Well, of course it does, if it's all lies. Right, but if you altered an existing register, instead of making one from scratch, the lies wouldn't be so obvious. Now, I'm thinking there was probably an actual shut-in named Ryo Aoki. Masato bought or stole Aoki's family register and is impersonating him. Is taking someone else's family register really that simple? I never said it was simple, but it is possible, especially if you've got money or the right connections. Don't you think, Kasuga? 
could be that the actual Aoki passed away and then he took the body of the young master and the young master took the identity of Aoki. That's a good. That's the a young guess. master would have had the money and connections to do it. So yeah, I can see it. But why would he go to all that trouble? To hide his Yakuza background so he could be governor. The public would never accept the politician with Yakuza roots. Ichiban, who told you that Masato was dead? One of my senpai from middle school, back in Kamurocho. It was just the other day, actually. Maybe the Arakawa family started spreading that rumor around themselves. Hold on! Hold the hell on! Uh-oh. How is Ryo Aoki walking? Does he not need a wheelchair anymore? And also, that's the what? police officer from the beginning of the game. The young master couldn't walk. He used a wheelchair. The governor can walk. Oh, then they can't be the same person. How could he hide? Hey, don't forget, he also used that experimental drug, which gave him a burst of energy so he could walk like a normal person. I had a disability like that. Well, the article said Aoki studied abroad in the U.S., right? Maybe he got surgery there. No, the doctor said he was wheelchair bound for life. Well, maybe here in Japan that's true, but sometimes you can get procedures done in the U.S. that uh, aren't available here. Hey, who's the guy who looks like there's a stick up his ass? That's the police commissioner, Orinouchi. Oh, your eternal rival. <laughs> I think I've seen him before. What? Sometime before I went to prison, uh, but when was it? Oh, right! I saw him at a cabaret club I took the young master to. Yeah, Horino Uchi was this dude that the young master's favorite girl was in love with. Ah, so the governor and the police commissioner used to be rivals in love. <laughs> Bet that made for a awkward meeting. Yeah, I'm sure they remember each other, especially if Ichiban does. I wonder what all went down. Damn, Kamroch is looking like a pretty big piece of the puzzle now. But I can't really put it all together yet. Confusing ass mess. Well, uh, no point in dwelling on it right now. Let's call it a day. I'm beat. But guys, remember what Mabuchi said? The Omi Alliance is going to invade. You can sleep after hearing that? Hell yeah. <laughs> it's not like we can do anything about it. Yeah, might as well sleep while you have the chance to. Tonight, Good be point. peaceful. Tomorrow, Let's head not. back and hit the hay. We don't even need to head back. Huh? Hey, barkeep. Remember when I asked you about that room on the second floor? Oh yeah, I cleaned it up for you. It's all yours. <laughs> nice. Thanks. What room? There's some vacant space on the second floor. Right, they're using it for storage right now, but I asked if we could use it as a hideout. Hide and I mean, seek. Your place Shoot. definitely has its mood and all, but it was uh getting kind of cramped. Here we'll have more room. Plus at night drink down here and then just stumble up to bed now's that for convenience uh, yeah it is great but you sure you're okay with this pal yeah whatever room wasn't being used for anything so it's no skin off my nose besides i don't know how but i heard you're fighting for the people of this town and well i'm not so desperate that i can't offer a shabby old room to a hero and his party wow dude thanks We'll keep the room as neat as you keep your bourbon. Hmm. Smooth. <laughs> wow. Enough with the whiskey puns, you two. You will drive me to drink. <laughs> hey, if you don't like my jokes, you can forget about using the rum. <laughs> Damn. Well, time to see all hell break loose. If the Omi does invade today. 
I should see. I should go see how the town's dealing with the threat of the Omni Alliance invasion. Alright. Side quests are still available, but I think as soon as I start walking, things happen. <laughs> oh, what did I just say? Yeah. Hey, uh, Hamako san, what's wrong? Some Yakuza came here looking for you. Uh, what? A guy named Totsuko from the Siryu clan. Totsuko, eh? How'd he look? He had a whole bunch of his boys with him. I think they're going to bar the bar asking about you. I'd steer clear from my place for a bit. Gotta go. Wait, Hamako san. Well, right, that doesn't sound good. Hey. What'd she say? Totsuko's apparently out searching for us, so she said we'd better stay clear from her shop. I mean, but I thought Totsuko was. Okay. Yeah, I thought the Serio clan came down hard on him for the whole retirement home scheme. Which means we should probably go see for ourselves. Even though she literally told us to stay away. <laughs> You're welcome to stay behind if you hey. want. Hey! Yes, I'm going too. Alright. So, we can go there, or I could take today to do side quests. I think I'd rather wait until a full party. Actually, I did say I was going to change classes, so give me a second. Take me to Hello Work, please. I went to the wrong one. Guess we're walking the rest of the way. I mean, yeah, hello works over there. Yeah, whatever. Oh, you know, I'll do this real quick. I told you I haven't stolen anything. Stop accusing me of what I didn't do. Where's this part-time hero? This, that must be my client. Time to play part-time hero. I've been framed as a thief, and now I'm being asked to hand over my belongings. Please believe me when I say I haven't stolen a thing. This is happening near the parking structure. I could really use a hero right now, because he needs a hero. This could get rough. Excuse me, but I'm a part-time hero, and this here's my client. I'll be inspecting his belongings. That way, no suspicious... The one suspicious gets it. So, what you try to say is, I'm a thief. That's slander, pal. I'm not getting... Let you get away with it. Oh man, you turn quickly. Yeah. All right. Um, I'll just you know, stab you. Oh, someone has jukes. Nice. I'm up. Oh, he had two. I'm ready now. That's how you do it. All right. Thanks. If you haven't been here on time, that jerk would have taken everything I had. Now I know who to call when there's trouble. Ghostbusters. With finesse. That dude started walking into a parking rail. Performers, guitar, sturdy lumber. Alright, now let's actually change my class, because I said I was going to. And then, when I'm done doing whatever, I'll probably farm off. Yeah, we'll just go to Hello Work, and um, I'm thinking of doing Breaker. Breaker sounds fun. Then again, one of us, need, I will actually have a dodgy be that one. The sledgehammer one. Construction. Alright, let's do it. I'm changing her as idle. I need a healer. Can I help you? Yes, you can. Thank you. All right, I'm level 11. What do you think? All right. Yeah. Oh, S. <laughs> yeah. So the last move you basically get for every class is around 28, and those are amazing. All right, we're changing you. Take your time. Also, hero. Essence of full swing. Essence of bone crushing. Uh, I could be a host. I think I got a bottle. A breaker, which I kind of want to do. Someone needs to do this because there's an ability I need from it. 
A uh, shaft? Eh, not really. I'm gonna be a breaker. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I actually like this. No, not that, sorry. This. Congratulations! Alright, Breaker, you are a foreman. You're doing great. And you shall be an idol. Night Queen. <laughs> and Matriarch is for other things. That will be endgame. I really like this pattern. Do your best out there. Thank you. Okay, it's on the check the gear. Alright, we got titanium anklets. Uh, okay, he is full dex, so I'm gonna dex it up. Um, oh yeah, all Namba's equipment's unequipped. Alright. Hmm. Alright, that increases healing, defense, defense. Work gloves is dexterity. That's actually really good. I'll take those. Alright. You got a wonky hammer. And I'm gonna increase your attack as much as possible. Alright, take the power ring off Psycho, because she won't be using it. Now I'm gonna give you healing, simple earrings, and I'm gonna take your binding off and give you... I want you to have some type of armor, so I'm gonna give you the chainmail. You have floral... okay. Alright, I'm feeling pretty good. Alright, let's do a few side quests since, you know... Um... Oh, he's at that seagull cinema. Damn it. I missed that one. I'll have to do it again. Actually, let's just go here. I'll do side quests when I actually have a full party. Yeah, uh, if there's one thing I don't like doing is side quests if I don't have a full party. Although, I think at the moment Namba is still getting the XP, it's just his drink clink. Oh, nice. Crazy Taxi. Style level 3. I also... Oh... I can do more Ichiban Confections. It just hit me. I could do more Ichiban Confections, but you guys are probably bored if I do that. Well, I can do... Yeah, let's just do a little story. First things first, let's fight the homeless. Do a radical drop. Oh, he does two. There. He is. Oh, I'm almost dead. Oh, this is a bad idea. Try this on the side. Alright, I still have shield blast, healthy routine. Uh I got this. I hate to say it, a man made a mistake. But I do not regret it. I might have oh. You're gonna be in a world. Give me a second, I'm gonna call my good old pound mate friend. Alright, this is actually very bad. Take your best shot. I got this. Going in. Damn it. Um. Just. Nine. Listen, I made mistakes. I know this, okay? I am. Uh, 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 Alright. I'm not the 
He's just a skater boy. Nice to see you later, boy. Alright, this is bad. I need to buy equipment. I might actually have to do the other thing. I am not happy. Let's go! Stay right there. Thank you for staying right there. I am going to heal. Oh, actually. That didn't heal as much as I wanted. <laughs> oh no. Oh. I can bring them back to life, but it costs, I think, a first aid. I do not want to. Oh, okay. I mean, that kind of sucks for me. Check this out! Okay, my defense rose. That's kicking time. Check this out. I keep being too late. Stop healing! Just die! Alright, give me a second. I'm dead. Yep. And this is what happens when you change a class and you're not prepared. That's on me. We need better gear. Alright. We don't have much money. I could do some financing, but yeah. I could do a few things, but nah. All right, let's just go each of our factions. Do uh, do it for one financial period, and then we'll buy new gear. Hi. The president is here. I definitely didn't just lose a battle. Yes, I would like to manage the business. Let's get down to business. All right, what do we got? Employees, recruit. We got this lady. All right, right now our employees, uh, we have two million. We can always, the problem is I can't upgrade service anymore. I need a good service one for, uh... yeah. Do, but open for business. We got a job to do. Let's 
We are officially rank 100. Goal achieved. Nick is going to be happy. <laughs> we did it! What? Huh? Oh, what's going on, Granny? Ichiban Confections is finally in the top 100 of the share price ranking. What? Huh? <laughs> what? You serious? That's great. Oh, boyfriend, you're amazing. Maybe we should go somewhere more private. Nah, that's okay. I'll sell for the compliments, I think. Oh. Probably Nick. Hey, sounds like you got yourself the top 100. Nicely done, Ichiban. Thanks. Thanks, Nick. But it's really only because of your investment. No. Actually, plenty of people fail, even with all the investments. You really were cut out to be a manager after all. It seems I wasn't wrong to believe so. I'm always willing to invest in people who bring results. Allow me to give you a, an additional investment, Ichiban-kun. Ichiban How's another 50 million yen set? Hmm? Uh-huh. You sure you want to give me that much? Absolutely. That amount will be chump changed once you reach the next level. But there's a condition this time as well, is that okay? Of course, what's the condition? Top 50. I want you to get in the top 50 of the share price ranking within that the given period. Things won't go smoothly from here on out. The shareholders will be harsher, and you're more than likely to be harassed by rival companies with a, let's say, less than favorable opinion of you. The amount of money you handle will increase, the responsibilities will be greater, knowing all that. Are you still up for the challenge? Okay. You have to ask. I live for fighting against the odds like that. Climb my way up from the bottoms while I do best. <laughs> Excellent. I knew you were the man for the job, Ichiban. In that case, I'll deposit the money right away. Use it carefully. I do look forward to seeing you succeed. Man, Nick is such a cool guy. Man. The next goal is the top 50, huh? I'm sure it's going to be a whole lot tougher, but that won't stop me. You received 50 million yen. Property management increased 2 to 4, employee count increased to 25. 25, not 25. 25. Oh, story time. Sir, a familiar name has appeared in the share price ranking. Oh. Really? What name is that? Ichiban Confections. Ichiban Confections? Isn't it that cracker shop that was on its way out? I heard some novice girl in here today, but I never thought she'd bring it back to life like that. She's an impressive one, that's for sure. Yeah. No, actually, that girl isn't the current president. Huh? What? Then who is it? Ichiban Kasuga, a former Yakuza thug who was supposedly homeless until just recently. Hey, I look good in that picture! Huh? You mean this idiot here is... Who's backing him? It's Nick Ogata. Oh! Huh? Uh? Huh? So? Nick Ogata. Let's do it again. Who sh what should we do, sir? Isn't it obvious we take immediate action like a good business should? <coughs> <coughs> Inhaled. <coughs> Nakawatari. As always, I'll be counting on you. Hey. Sir, sure, leave it to me. I'll give it everything I've got. Just try not to draw too much attention to yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. All right, Mishimi. Let's come up with a plan. Right! I inhaled my saliva. It... Mm, I'm good now. Are you sure about this? This guy's as violent as he is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's call it a trial run. As a company that gets crushed by a moron like Nakanawateri, they will be doomed from the start. 
Ichiban Kasuga. I look forward to seeing how you fare. I just wanted the money, and now I'm making rivals. Let's do our best to reach our next goal, Kazuga-san. Alright. Okay. Right on. Hmm? What's wrong, Eri-chan? Uh, oh, it's nothing. She doesn't seem to be herself. wonder if maybe something's bothering her. Sup? Hey, Eri-chan, if you're up for it, you want to go out for a drink? Oh, with you, Kazuga-san? Yeah, we could celebrate getting to the, into the top 100 while we're at it. We've been so busy running a company, I didn't realize we haven't gotten to talk all that much. Unless you're not up to it for that. Oh, no. Of course I am. I've been wanting to spend time with you, Kazuga-san. Alright then, let's do it. We can go to this place called Survive. It's one of my favorite bars, and it's just up yes. the street. You should, oh, sure. I'll get my uh, right before I go. So let's meet at the bar. Okay, I'll see you there. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, I can slap people with a, a stack of money, and it does a decent amount of damage. Yeah. Give me a second. There it is. Stack slap. An enemy just won't learn their lesson. You'll need to be... You, they'll need to slap harder. Yeah, you slap them with money, you lose the money, but deals a decent amount of damage. Alright, gonna have to go up the street to survive. Hurry, run across the street and don't get hit by a car. I guess this one is gonna be a side quest one. Nah. Oh well, I'll do some uh, farming and all that off screen. But yeah, this one's gonna be a side quest, uh episode at this point because I'm at the farm. <laughs> Where is she? Oh, there she is. Oh, Chief. Hey, I keep you waiting? No, I actually just got here. So I see you brought a friend. You're smoother than you look. Come on, man. She's an employee of mine. Is she now? Were you homeless just the other day? And now you're some corporate big shot? Yep. <laughs> it's a long story. One I'll say for another time. Right now, we're here to celebrate. So how about you work us some magic? Huh. Fine, then. So, we made it to the top 100. I think that calls for a toast. Cheers! Ooh. <sighs> That's good. I wanted to start off with a thank you for all your support. I mean, if it wasn't for you... I wouldn't be president of anything. You're just being modest. If anything, I should be thanking you. If I weren't so naive, I wouldn't have had to drag you into this mess. But you, you're just what a company needs. You're decisive, dependable, a good judge of character. Life itself is better with you around, Kasuga-san. Speaking of character, let's talk about the guy who pulled one over on you. Who is this jerk ass anyway? He's the president of a very big firm here in Yokohama. Serious? And he just preyed on you out of nowhere? Yeah. I never thought a professional on his level would do that. You see, I just inherited my company and didn't have a clue how to run it. It was a time I really needed somebody to count on. Then suddenly I met this business tycoon who seemed really genuine. I ate up every word he said. And you paid the price for it. Yeah. <sighs> every time I think about it, I feel so stupid. Well, it's not like anyone can really blame you, right? I probably would have done the same thing if I was in your shoes. Really? Yeah. And remember, the fault lies with the deceiver, not the deceived. You did what anyone would do. I know you're just trying to process things, but you don't have to beat yourself up. Kasuga-san. You're right. I know it's 
pointless to punish myself over something in the past. Yep. And no matter what kind of company the shitbag runs, he's going down. Together we'll climb the ranks, make it to the top, and leave him begging for mercy. Yeah, we will. We'll even get big enough to completely buy him out. We'll take back all the businesses he stole, and start our own holdings company. I like the sound of that. And with that attitude, nothing's gonna stop us. So keep your chin up, yeah? Enjoy the ride. Right. <laughs> There's that airy chan smile. Honestly, I saw you looking kind of down, so I got a bit worried. Oh, was I acting strange? Sorry, it's just... Something on your mind? You know you can always talk to me. How should I explain this? I was just thinking about my dad. Oh, yeah? It's like... Um... Whenever I see you smile, I always think of my dad. You two are so alike. That's why I got so emotional all of a sudden. But I wasn't feeling down or anything. Don't worry. Oh, okay. Wait a sec, though. If I remind you of your dad, does that mean... Let's see... Ah, he has an amazing personality. He had an amazing personality? <laughs> well, someone sure sounds confident. <laughs> but... You're not wrong. In any case, I wasn't referring to your appearance. It's the way you carry yourself. You're funny, outgoing, always full of energy. You make everyone around you smile. My dad was just like that. He always made me feel safe and secure. To be honest, so do you. <laughs> Is that right? I wish I could have met the guy. Sounds like we would have hit it off. <laughs> I'd like to think so. All right. Then for an awesome dad like yours, I'll put my heart and soul into making Ichiban Confections the best it can be. Now, there's no way I could ever replace your old man. But I can protect his legacy. Would you help me do that, Eri-chan? I don't think I can do it alone. You won't have to. I'll help you every step of the way. Please. But I know you've got so much on your plate already. You're sure you'll be okay? Oh, well, I know this won't be a walk in the park. But I have good people on my side. Good people? Yeah. A group I trust with my life. Can't get much done without them. So I'm sure it'll all work out. Call it a gut feeling. <laughs> Bet they'll give me tons of shit for overdoing it, though. <laughs> Sounds like... you're all close. Hey, you okay there? Kasuga-san... Could I ask you a favor? Uh, yeah, what's up? Do you think... I could ever be part of your inner circle? Huh? Look, you've been doing so much for me since the day we met. But I feel like all I ever do is watch from the sidelines. That's not really fair, is it? So I was thinking I could play a more active role in your daily affairs. That way you could focus more on management without feeling bogged down by all your other stuff. That's a win for you and our company, right? I can't think of a reason for me not to join. I don't know. We all walk a pretty tough road. Shit gets out of hand non-stop. You don't want to risk getting hurt, do you? I'm fully aware of the risk. A and trust me, I won't be a burden on that front. Okay, but... Harry-chan, as much as I like the idea, I just don't see it happening. Please. Let me be the one doing you the favor. Besides, if you say no, I'll just tag along without your approval. <laughs> Guess that doesn't leave me much choice. Don't expect any hand-holding, though. Me. Okay. I'd say that's worthy of a toast. Welcome to the party, Eri Chan. We just Cheers. got our optional party member.
And by the way, Eri Chan will be tagging along from this point on. I'm Eri. I'm excited to get to know everyone. Are you sure about this? Knowing us will probably bring you nothing but trouble. Yeah, we're always in one mess or another. Doesn't help that we got these two drunks either. <laughs> Look who's talking. You don't have to worry about me. I just want to repay you for all the kindness you've shown me. And I'm ready for just about anything. Just about, huh? <laughs> well, I can't argue with that. Good to have you. Welcome to the gang, Eri Chan. Thank you for having me. You got the optional party member. Unlike the rest of your party members, Ares' bond level only increases as you grow your business. Increasing her bond has many benefits, such as giving her access to new jobs and skills, keeping your business skills sharpened, and deepen your bond with Ari. And... Alright, Ares' sweet and caring disposition has given her natural aversion to sleep and rage. And... Oh, wait, what? You're ready for one? I didn't know about that. Really? I didn't think she was ready for a link yet. Man, everyone wants to talk to me. Oh, she looks mad. Right. Uh, yeah, okay. Thanks for letting me know. Hmm. Guess Sai Chan's on the phone. Who's she talking to? What's up, Sai Chan? Looking kind of down there. Oh, Ichiban. Something happened on the phone? Just... Uh, more Nanoha drama. I'm starting to get all too clear a picture of that jerk she's dating. Oh yeah, Katsuragawa, right? The consulting guy, or whatever. The girls from the club looked into him? They saw him with Nanoha on a date. Look at this picture they took. And that's Nanoha and Katsuragawa? Yeah. Doesn't he look shady as hell? What is she thinking? Hey, I get what you're saying, but you can't judge someone just from the way they look. Okay, take a look at this picture then. See the guy in the background with the sunglasses? His name's Yamashita, and he's like the bodyguard in Katsuragawa's creepy little posse. Bringing a bodyguard on a date? Yeah, that's definitely out of the ordinary. You think? And to make matters worse, the girls told me the conversation he had with Nanoha. It was 100% bad news. I'm sure Katsuragawa has it in for her. What do you mean? What did you girls hear? Katsuragawa's consulting firm isn't doing so hot right now, so he wants to borrow money from Nanoha. How much? Two million. Yeah, that's a lot. He decided a date was a good time to ask for a huge loan? <laughs> I think even I've got more game than this guy. But anyway, Nanoha said no, right? I mean, she needs that money to support her dad. Actually... When my dad switched facilities, Nanoha found out she had a little more spending money. Apparently, she's already lent him 500,000, and now he's asking for 2 million more! Seriously? Good. Even if Nanoha has that much to spare, she should be saving it for her future. And Katsuragawa knows that. But somehow, he found out Nanoha used to work at Orohime Land. He did? So he asked her to go back and start making bank again. What? Oh dear. And this is the guy who didn't even bother to help her when she was in trouble. In fact, I think he basically stopped calling her right after Dad started to need round-the-clock care. But now that that's dealt with, and Katsuragawa knows about Nanoha's stint at the Soapland, he's trying to schmooze his way back in. I mean, Nanoha's not an idiot. She can always just change the subject whenever he asks for money, can't she? Don't you remember how she wanted to go out with him way back when I first said no? She was head over heels for him back then. I don't know how she feels now, but... It sounded like she held off on saying yes or no, but... I'm afraid she might actually go back to the soap land. You think so? Damn, this guy's a piece of work. If this he really does roll with a biker gang, he must be as the shit stuck on their tires. 
What other kind of guy would be pushing his girlfriend to work at a soap land? To cover for his failures? So you're having the exact same thoughts as me. Nice to know I'm not crazy. Crazy? Sajan, even if he wasn't such a bastard, Nanoha could still do better. We gotta get him away from her, before she gets scammed and hung out to dry. But Nanoha never listens to me. She's not about to start now. You know what? Leave her to me. Well, if she won't listen to you, maybe she'll listen to me. <laughs> what? You? She has no Why one. not? We both used to work at Orohime Land, so it's not like we're complete strangers. But yeah, just leave it to me. She and Katsuragawa are history. Well, wait a second. If you go meet up with her, don't you think she's gonna wonder how you know about Katsuragawa? I'll just say Saiko told me. No, you can't tell her that you and I know each other. Huh? Think about it from Nanoha's perspective. She'll say to herself, if Saiko knows about this, then she must know about the soap land. Don't you see? Hmm. <sighs> Guess you have a point there. My bad. It's okay. I can tell how much you care about this, and I really appreciate it. I don't know what good it will do, but I'll give her a call. Never hurts to try. All right. Good luck. Sorry to make you listen to all my family drama, Ichiban. That's no problem. I care about Nanoha, too. She's my ex-co-worker, after all. Still, thanks. Yeah, that guy's a douchebag. No way is this over. Wonder what'll happen. They'll probably get in an argument <laughs> Look over the at phone. Me. I'm just as nosy as Sachan. Yeah, they'll probably get in an argument over the phone. Let me just punch the guy in the face. Break his teeth. Now his nose, just his teeth. Nose can be fixed. Teeth. <laughs> Yay. Okay, she will get more XP. I'm shocked I filled her link. I don't remember. I didn't think I did, but apparently I did. All right. We're going to get some money. Some dosh. Some cash. Some moolah. Some green mean. Uh, actually, what is her class? One second. Oh god. Okay, here we go. Gear, what are you? You are a clerk. Okay, and you have a box cutter. Alright, that is your optimal gear. I'll give you that. And that. But I... Oh, wait. Clerk is actually a pretty decent class. On top of that, she can throw... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 while well, her moves is... Looks yeah, funny. I remember now. Alright, back to making money. I am a broke man who's broke, broke. I need equipment, and then I'm gonna probably farm some levels off video after the end of this. I'll do some of this. I'll do it once. Oh, wait, wrong way. I'll do it once, get a little paycheck, and then I'm gonna do a few side quests, and then I'll go call it, and then I'm gonna just go in the dungeon and get some levels. Alright, we have an extra Let's five get down mil, because Nick is awesome. Oh, 50 mil, never mind. All right, this is where I start cheating. Get ready for this. Immediately we're buying a property. Oh yeah, why wouldn't we? All right. High-end brothel, hmm. All right, uh, I wanna find an employee who, oh hey man, how you doing? He's great at food. All right, he's great at food, so let's see. Can we find a food place? Okay, this is a food place, and it'd be great for him. Immediately acquiring it. Now I'm gonna get an employee, I'm gonna recruit him, because he's free. Yeah, Alright. Yeah. Don't go too hard on me, huh? <laughs> I'm gonna assign him. I'll handle this. Alright, immediately he's running the place just fine. Alright. Yeah, actually he's running it just fine by himself. This place is still, or I'll leave it alone. It's doing its thing. Let's uh, upgrade these. All 
All right, level is max, and he's literally gonna run up by himself. Jeez. All right, once again, we're going to the market. What do we want? Actually, let me go to employees and recruit. Okay, who's good here? You're amazing at money. All right. Do we have any banks? No, we do not have banks unlocked yet. All right, money, money. We can get him, Nick Ogata. But we need a, okay, we need one of those buildings. Properties, market. Do we have any of those unlocked yet? Probably not, no, okay. Oh wait, I'm looking at the wrong pictures, God damn it! She's, okay. I'm gonna get her to help me. <laughs> Hope this is worth my time. All right, she uses the blue properties. So these guys. All right, we got this one and this one. Mm, sales volume 608, sales volume 500. Honestly, this one's a lot better. Hey, anyway, I have the money. I am going to use it. All right, immediately. I'll take care of it. Leader. All right, we're gonna upgrade. All right, and once again, she's gonna run it beautifully by herself. This place, though, I can't really do much with at the moment. I need someone better at service, but. Yeah, these two aren't the best, but I will leave it. But. All right. Ichiban Confections is fully upgraded. All right. Now let's see what happens we, we open for business. Time to rake in the profits. Employees are motivated. I'm gonna let this go out until <laughs> normal speed. <laughs> Immediately, Ichiban Confections is in the green. Holy cow. <laughs> I'd expect no less. Typical setback. <laughs> Alright. Oh my god, Ichiban Confections is raking it in. Alright, let's I speed up. No Here's the result. Is this what you were expecting? Uh, still make it rain. <laughs> Here's where the business did. Yeah. <laughs> These are nice. incredible results. Amazing. We're going up. All right, where are we? I'm gonna say we're going up to 97. Oh, there am I? I lied. I'm sorry. All right, employees. All right, hi guys. How are y'all doing? Auto care. Oh wait, no, actually everyone's still quite happy. Perfect. Um, I could get more employees to help at the other ones, which honestly would be a very smart thing to do. All right. Well, let me see. Notability. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I can upgrade the product again here. There you go. I could find someone who actually is good at this. Uh, this is a red build. Yeah, it's a red building. Cause, all right, let me see what we got. Employees, what do we got for reds? All right, actually we got Nick Ogata and Daigo. Daigo. I don't know who these two are, Yuki and uh, I don't know those two. All right, Nick. Let me lead you to success. All right, Nick, you are officially one of my employees. Let me assign you to the place that needs you the most. <laughs> what a wise choice. All right, I'm gonna stick the other employee with him. He is not employed. Oh, I got that. Give him a little help. It is officially Max. Go away. I have all the employees I need at the moment. We got a job Let's to do. Open for business. Oh yeah. Time for profits. Let's make a magic happen. 
That would happen. Oh, joy. I'd expect no less. <laughs> I'd expect no less. Oh, Here's the result. Is this what you were expecting? Uh, still Ooh. make it rain. Man, she's she's like the perfection. Dish. She's hot right now. These are incredible results. Nice. You guys did great out there. All right. Those are going up. All right. We went up 200. Uh, uh 200. Are we going? Oh, we're going up. Let's keep it up. Our ranking went up. Hey, what? 99. I'm happy. Present cows. I do not have the money for that. I do not have the money for that. Sorry. The shareholders meeting is coming up soon. We got some new people I can hire, but I hate to say it, I do not need that. We're gonna use some auto care. We got a job to do. I'm very happy with how these. So yes, technically I'm cheating. I'm using the really good people you can buy for free, but they're still salaried. You still have to pay. Oh, oh, joy. But oh, I'm extremely oh, happy how well this is going. Oh joy. And then when you get the rank 50, you can get the really good buildings. Like if you think Ichiban Confections is raking it in right now, picture about three times that. These are nice. Oh, perfect. Here's a going up. Ooh, another 200. Are we leveling up? Or are we staying the same? Oh, we're leveling up. That's what I'm talking Our about. Went up. All right. The shareholders meeting is about to begin. All right, shareholder meeting. And because of the shareholder meeting, let me make everyone happy. All right, let me change the board. I immediately, I got better people. Her. <laughs> I'll show them a thing or two. Nick Ogata. Let's break a leg. And, uh... Mm. Who's on it? Everyone's happy except that guy. He is mad. All right, one second. So do I want... Okay, we have green... Consider the yeah, shareholders we'll handled. We'll start with the financial report. President Kasuga, if you would. One day I'm gonna run a beach, an island, if you will. We'll kick things That's off shocking. With the oh yeah. We're at 65. Let's do this. Thank you. Let's move on to the Q and A. Please raise your. Let's get rid of him first. You're missing the forest. Please raise your hand if you have a question. Oh, trust me, these do actually do get hard. Just right now, it's. Concludes our periodic shareholders meeting. Oh yeah, everyone's happy. Well, everybody, this calls for a celebration. And the really good thing about this mode is even if you have those guys, you do not have to use them. Oh, Jesus, that's an increase. But yeah, you don't have to use these people if you want to do it actually legit. I'm doing the easy mode since this is the second time I'm playing the game. You should saw me the first time I did this. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Oh. I got money. All right, that. I'm calling it here. For this, I'll do a little more next time. Alright. Okay. Mm -hmm. My employees are kicking butt. Alright, let me promote them. <laughs> it's about time. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Grandma can go up to level 20. <laughs> nice. Uh, Alright. Yeah, everyone has their own... <laughs> I can keep promoting Omelette, but I still don't get why I have to pay Omelette. He lives here for free. All right, I think we got some progress with money. So yeah, that's the best way to farm cash in this game. One of the best ways. There's probably way better ways to do it, uh, farm for cash. But that is my favorite way to farm cash because it's quick and simple. Very simple. Now, should I go to Hell of Work and change her starting class? I don't think so. Yeah, I'm gonna keep her job for now, because it's actually a really good job. Thumbtack Scatter. Yeah, that one hurts. But yeah, I'm gonna keep it, 
for now. Essence of Telephone Nunchaku. <laughs> yeah. Nah, we'll keep that class for her for now. Let's start doing side quests since I'm already an hour in. I'm gonna pause this real quick. I'm gonna go grab a cup of coffee so you will not know I pause it. Alright. Let's do some side quests. What's with the crowd? Sorry to disturb you during your recovery, honey Amazon. Can you tell us what happened out there? Honey Amazon, have you had any further contact with Anzai san since the incident? No, none at all. Just an apology from a representative. Anzai san insists the play was entirely his doing. He performed a dangerous slide despite the fact that he was in the clear already. How did you see things, Honey Amazon? That's not far off, but I don't believe he made that call on his own. Home run heroism. We understand that Anzai san is an old friend of yours. What sort of player was he back then? They say playing as number four next season's a fool's errand. What are your thoughts on that? There are even rumors Anzai san will be leaving the Yokohama Shark Stars. Famous baseball player or not, these reporters are ruthless. Hey, please, no pushing. Ah! <clears throat> ah. Hey, this shit's serious. You all right, man? Ah. Thanks. Honey, Amazon, we still have some questions. Hey, aren't you gonna apologize for pushing him over? Yeah, I, I didn't. Assholes, this guy's injured and you don't even think to say sorry? <laughs> oh, 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 I'm sorry. Stupid journalist. Sheesh. You guys are hopeless. <sighs> Thank you. <sighs> Can you stand? Here, grab my shoulder. Thank you. Um, Kasuga-san, was it? I'm Hanayama. Might not look it right now, but I'm actually a baseball player. So, that leg, that because of your friend Anzai? Being an athlete's not all it's cracked up to be, huh? You could say that. This whole thing is really starting to make headlines. You haven't heard? Sorry, I tend to keep my distance from that stuff. From what the reporters were saying, Anzai acted on his own. I don't think so. He's not the type to do something like that. Pretty kind words about a guy who put you in a cast. We were in the same baseball club from elementary all the way through high school. His accuracy's always been perfect, so no way this was an accident. But he cared about the team with all his heart, was always a true sportsman on the field. He put the bond with his teammates above all else, even winning. I just can't believe this thing was all his idea. Even if that were true, he's still the one who made the play, right? You saying someone ordered him to do it? I'm thinking it was the Yokohama Shark Stars shifty manager. That's Anzai's team, if you didn't know. The manager? Why do you say that? Since the new manager stepped in, the Shark Stars have been locked in second place. That's not gonna change anytime soon. Hell, people were saying the new manager would have to retire before the ink on his contract dried. Unless they got a win, of course. And if they could pull off winning the last game, they probably would have won the season. So the guy got impatient and ordered Anzai to take you out. I'm guessing there's some reason Anzai couldn't say no, right? That's what I'm thinking. But Anzai swears he did it on his own. Speaking of which, I'm surprised you're willing to hear me out. Anzai is basically public enemy number one right now. Even if he is your friend, nobody be willing to defend someone they knew was lying. I like you, Kasuga-san. You know what's up. It makes me think I could trust you with a favor. A favor? I'd like you to meet with Anzai and find out what really happened. With the shape I'm in, I can't exactly hop across town. Meet with Anzai? But if you can't even get to him, how can I? There's a place on Hamakaze Street he hangs around in. Usually in disguise. Probably there now. The... Uh, in disguise? Are you sure he'd want you sharing that? I'm sharing because you did me a solid. Because you don't just believe whatever the mob believes. Rare thing. Uh, look, I'll uh, make it worth your while yep. if you help me out with this. I am. <laughs> like I'm gonna say no after all that? Yeah, fine. I'll go ask him for you. Ah, oh, thanks, Kasuga-san. Ah, oh, here. Let me give you this. 
A photo of Anzai. His looks might have changed a bit, but this should help you find him. I'm counting on you, man. Off to Hamakaze Street. That's a suspicious man right there. Alright, let me make sure I actually started the recording. Okay, it would have been funny if I didn't. Alright, so he's here. No, that's actually a different one. Okay. Oh, okay, so we got some there, there. There's a lot. Oh, that's the, the one that can't, the lady, okay. Oh, Aerie is a higher level than everybody. Fair. Alright, let's be careful of battles. I'm a, I'm a wimp at the moment. I should take an taxi to the stupid romance workshop so I can see what I can make. I mean, technically I can go to a weapon shop. There's actually quite a few weapon shops that are hidden across the city that you need the... Uh, you need the foreman ability to basically break the walls. Alright, I have 200,000. Let's see if I can make anything. Everyone, follow me. Hey, how you doing? Alright, flaming lump. That is useless. Nothing for breaker, foreman, idol, cleric, another, okay. I could fund her, but that's all I got. Let's craft armor. What do we have? I can make a trick hat, but I can only make a couple. I can make two pirate hats. Uh, yeah, Nuve Rich. Boost the amount of money you gain from enemies. Now that's nice, but I need more golden things. That's actually a pretty good armor. Alright. Sorry, I guess I wasted your time. Actually, wait. Not hello work. We're going to ignore that for now, because I have two going already, and I'll be back. We're going to love magic. If there's any new weapons for me to buy, I'll just get them at Love Magic. Nope, sorry, I'm not hired. Oh, jeez. Right. You're in it now. Take your best shot. Yes. Right. Um, let's just finish him off. I'm up! Actually, I should do a reckless charge. Go in it. You're in it now. Perfect. <laughs> nice. <laughs> she attacks with scissors and a box or a box cutter. Yeah, I would uh do not mess with someone who did that. All right, just. Whack him with your stick. Good luck next time. All right. Another Tojo clan crest. I forgot where that person is. I have to look at the uh, text later. First things first. Let's go to Love Magic. See if I can buy any new weapons. Right. Nope. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Adults ruler. Let's flip it on her. Immediately better. Nope, nope. Yes, actually. Sexy microphone. Chance to apply charm. A toy bracelet. Just increases the magic. I can also. Hmm, I might go here also. I can look at what they have there. I have a little money, I'm going to try and upgrade myself. And then as the classes level up, we'll be good to go. Alright, here, here. I have 170,000 and I could just farm for money. 
which I will do on screen when I do the market thing, because, yeah, there's some story with that. Alright, what do we got? Immediately better, but I'm going to hold off. Alright, it's better. That's worse. That's oh, shocking. Alright, well, we'll get this. And I guess we'll get this. Alright, I think we're good. Now let's do the side quest. Uh oh. Alright. Someone's here. Alright. Rolling kick. I'll show you. I'm not backing down. Oh yeah. You know what? I'm gonna nope, nope, don't wanna actually waste money, let's not do it. Come on now. I was really beautiful. Right. You sure you can beat me? Oh, Sean, perfect. Oh yeah. Oh, there's a guy. I was trying to attack the other one. Cool. You sure you want to get hurt? Here we go. Get cocky. Wait, what am I aiming for? Oh no, that's sand. I hate sand. It's coarse and it gets everywhere. All right, that should level us up. I feel the stats going up. <laughs> nice. Yes. MP. That's an odd one. Healing plus five. That's great. And agility. All right, want we'll to go to the Suchimon place? We got two quests going on right now, and then I'll do the others as we go. I stopped at the wrong taxi. I blame myself for this. Now we're here. Yeah, we want to go down. Just don't go. Oh, we're going this way. And this is the top notch weapon shop, as you can see. That is. Gonna take a bit. Oh wait! It burns! It burns! It burns! Hmm? Whoa! The hell just happened to him? Uh, uh, this isn't selling at all. Oh, oh! How about you, young man? Want to buy some kimchi? Just whipped up a fresh new batch. Well, it isn't fresh, strictly speaking, but don't go calling it old. I won't, but why are you selling kimchi out ah. here? Why? To earn a living, of course. It's nice to be out in the city talking to locals. Makes good for good advertising, I guess. So, how about it? Wanna try a little sample? <clears throat> oh, can I? Since I'm here, I might as well. Oh, looks good. <laughs> <laughs> Just having it in front of me makes my mouth water. All right, here goes nothing. Mm. Just the right amount of crunch, and it's got a nice kick. Er, wait, this is more than a kick. Holy, oh my. It burns, it burns, it burns. <clears throat> well, uh, did you like it? You bastard, did I like it? What is in this stuff? It was like chewing hot glass. Oof, okay, I think I'm cooling down. Huh. You know, now that the spice wore off, I can actually taste the rest of it, and it's good. No, it's damn good. It's got this sort of pepper pepperiness to it. Maybe all that spice lacked a hidden flavor. And even though the spice really kicked my ass, I kind of want Yo. more. You gotta tell me, Gramps, what's in this kimchi? <laughs> <laughs> it seems you've learned to appreciate the finer sub... Sub, sub, please, uh, sub, sub. 
of kimchi. Kudos to you. To make this concoction of mine, I use a secret pepper. Gives it a subtle pickets, unlike any other. Not to mention any other. Oh, okay. Pepper's known as the Devil's Claw, by the way. Won't find it in a market, that's for sure. Devil's Claw? No wonder it's hot. Mm. Fortunately, not everyone can bear the intensity. Most people take off running before they discover its true potential. But that's why that other dude is running around all crazy. Kimchi works wonders on your health, particularly your skin. But I suppose it's a hard sell. People start screaming bloody murder. <sighs> well, it does pack a punch, though. I, I thought I was going to die for a second. No one's ever died eating kimchi. It's enjoyed by people of all ages. <clears throat> that being said, it seems like no one around here actually wants my kimchi. It makes me very sad. Yeah, I can imagine. Crazy how one little pepper had so much heat. Oh yes, and there are, other, are peppers out there to add more than just spice. Some are even sweeter than cherry tomatoes. All that aside, I firmly believe that cabbage fermented with devil's claw results in some truly amazing kimchi. <laughs> well, I'm glad at least one person to try it. Doesn't do much to reassure me, but I'll take what I can get. Too bad it nearly melts your mouth before you finally start to enjoy it. <sighs> But if no one can handle the heat, then my kimchi's going nowhere. A product that won't sell is no good. Anyway, I'm thinking of closing up shop for today. So how about you take the rest of this batch off by hand? Hmm? Whoa, you sure? So okay. Yeah, you'll give it to your friends, do whatever you like. <sighs> As for me, I'm gonna go shuffle on out of here. <sighs> That's a nice gesture, but I can't imagine who would want to eat this. Miracle Kimchi times three. Alright. I think it's time for me to tell you about an amazing item. Unless I don't have it technically. There it is. Alright. So there's there and there. Let's go north. Well, I'm going to a dead end, but I'm avoiding another side quest. I'm trying to do these two and then I'll do other side quests. I'm not trying to avoid on purpose. I just want to try and stick to. Ooh. Should I open it? Yeah. Got it. Auntie. Oh, what, 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 I just bought her one. I'm going to be mad. Okay. Yeah, no. It's actually not that good. Also, you can get Airy Chan earlier. I held off until now, till we lost Nanba for a bit. Well, who knows how long a bit's gonna be. Could be the rest of the game, could be five minutes, five seconds, but yeah. But yeah, I wanted to hold off until I was down to three party members. Then I don't have to worry about, you know, moving people around. So at the moment, she shall take over where Nanba left off. Man, I'm just getting all the Tojo Clan crests right now. Alright. Wait, really? There's another taxi right there? Those two are really close together. Kind of a waste if you ask me. Right now, today for dinner, we're having homemade chicken parm, and it smells of amazing. Oh, I cannot wait to sink my teeth into that. I'm trying my best not to, like, munch on anything until dinner. I don't want to ruin my appetite. S.O.S. I really should have stayed inside today. Isn't that part-time hero supposed to be here by now? This must be my client. Time to play part-time hero? 
All I want to do is take a walk, and now these people are threatening me. Why does this always happen? I may be on Yokohama Boulevard, but I'm in dire straits. You know what? Time to hustle! Never fear, part-time heroes here to help. Don't try acting cool. I'll beat your ass and take your money too. Oh, you're gonna beat my ass. Okay. Yeah. Hate to say it, dear I'm sir, sorry, but yeah. you know what? I've had it with you. Haste Don't my money. Oh, her down tech is really good. Right. Eh, just twirling baton. Smash, 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 smash. Still made it. Let's go. Dude. Let's go. I'm getting my boss hammer ready. You serious right now? Come on now. Oh no. Oh, he's in love with me. Nice. Oh, beautiful. I love her down attack. It's so good. Good luck next time. You know, I was pretty skeptical at first. Skeptical. Holy cow, not skeptical. Skeptical at first, but part time hero really does deliver. I feel the world's much safer with you people around. With finesse. With finesse. We got it. Alright, let's go north and uh, see what's up. You know, maybe I'll just, yeah, I'm um, not sure when I'll do it, but I'll do all part-time hero stuff on screen sometime. Oh, hey, hi, girl. <sighs> Senpai, don't leave Yo. me. Hey, are you alright? Uh, sorry, it's just I thought you were crying. Oh, yeah, I guess I was. Sup? I could always lend an ear if you want. Helps to let it out sometimes, you know. But if you don't want to vent to some stranger, I get that too. To be honest, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. But I sent I who I loved for so long is suddenly going to study abroad. Wow. Uh, okay. And after he gets back, he's gonna be going straight to college, which is far away from here. I came to the station to let him know my feelings, but the thought of never seeing him again has reduced me to tears. Tears that won't stop flowing. I get it now. So, senpai yours, is he already gone? Aww. No, he's at the platform. But that means he's almost gonna leave now. Right. I want nothing more to go see him off, but I can't let my senpai see me like this. Not my eyes all puffy and my makeup smeared. I look disgusting. Oh, come on, it's not that bad. It is too. And I would die if he only remembers me as some sobby, snout dripping mess. <sighs> But I'd also die to just see him one more time, to set him off with a warm smile, maybe a warm kiss, but that'll never happen. Hmm. Hey, hey. No need to be so down on yourself. I know. I should just go. Senpai's right up those stairs, too. But if I see him, I'll be a total disaster. I'm sure of it. Uh, what should I do? It feels like my feet are stuck in place. I can't move forward or back. It's like, no matter what I do, it's gonna turn out wrong. Letting go of someone is always hard. I wish there was some way I could help. All she needs is the courage to take the first step forward. Yeah, l l let's poison her. <laughs> Too bad she's not like that businessman running full speed ahead. Of course, that was only cause of the kimchi. Uh, is something wrong? You well, quite all of a sudden. Oh no, I'm good. Now, there's an idea. I give her some ultra spicy kimchi. She runs up the stairs without a second thought. But her farewell might be ruined if she's if the stuff's too strong. What's the best option here? Here. Listen, I know it's tough being away from someone you really care about. I would know. You would? Yeah. Yeah. And all you want to do is give him a piece of your mind, right? Yes, but my feet won't move no matter what I do. Then 
Why don't I give you a little push? Here. Don't ask. Just eat. on. Ew. No. Why kimchi? Or why are you trying to feed me? I'm not trying to feed you. I'm offering you a shortcut to success. Now, get over yourself and try it. This is the stupidest thing I ever heard, and from a stranger no less. Thinking kimchi's gonna solve my problems. The train will be arriving shortly on platform one. Please wait behind the yellow line. Hey. Hey. Clock's ticking. You have to leave right now or it's game over. Ask yourself, do I want to see my senpai or not? Wakatta. Fine. If Kimchi's gonna help, I'll do it. But I doubt this will change anything. What? This is way too spicy. Wah, this is way too spicy. This is way. Ah. Ooh. Well, that's one way to light the fire. Maybe I'll check back on her in case. <laughs> Hmm? Hmm? Excuse me, you can't go without purchasing a ticket, sir. Even if you're seeing someone off. Ah, right. Damn it. What would happen if I had no money? I'm curious, but oh well. Looks like the train took off. Hope she made it in time for her senpai. Kyoko! What's wrong with you? Your face is all red! <laughs> it was the kimchi. Here, let me get you some first aid in the office. No, I'll be alright. It's not as bad as it looks. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'm sorry. I made you miss your train. That's not what's important. I'm just glad you're okay. Senpai. Mm -hmm. Listen, there's something I need to tell you. Mm -hmm. Oh, what is it? I've been feeling this way for a long time, and... Yeah, this would be a good time to bail. Yeah, your face is a little red. Hey. Yo, you tell him how you feel? Oh. Yeah, I did. And guess what? We're going to the same college. Once I graduate high school, that is. He did say he'd be waiting for me, though. Sweet. So it all worked out, huh? I think so. It's going to be lonely road up until then. Plus, I'm kind of ditz. I didn't even know if I, I'll even get accepted. Arigato. But even so, I'll not let that deter me. And hey... Thanks for helping the girl out. <laughs> oh, it's cool. Must be nice to be young and in love. See, your face was as leaky as a faucet, your cheeks were as red as tomato. But a beautiful smile is what really counts. <laughs> Gee, thanks. I really could have done without the kimchi, you know. Uh, yeah, probably. My bad. <laughs> Sheesh. Well, I guess I should go study. Gotta work hard to get to the right school. Okay. Yeah, I bet. Good luck. Hey, actually, that kimchi wasn't that bad. Thanks for the snack. I should be the one thanking you. Mm. You showed me just how useful a container of kimchi can be. Maybe I'll share this with others who look like they need it. Are there other people who need this? Yes, the answer is yes. All right, time to go north. I am needed up here, or am I stick with the kimchi quest for now? If so, I have no idea where the second part is. Here? Here? I don't know, one of these is kimchi and the other one is... What was the other quest I triggered? Right. Okay, is this the avenue? No, okay, so that's the baseball. That's baseball. Okay, okay, we're good. I was gonna say, one of them's the baseball and one of them's the kimchi. Right, he said the avenue. Uh oh, hello. That place. Oh, damn it. This is the, the baseball. Anzai, like, should be around here somewhere. Oi. Hey, you're. Hey, you're Anzai, the guy with the killer slide. We lost a game because of you. What's worse, Hanamiya's out for a season. The hell were you thinking? I do like some baseball now and then. Well, the beard's new, but that's definitely the guy in the photo. 
Looks like he's got company, though. Eh? Quit being a tough guy. Quit with the tough guy act and say something. <laughs> that was my fault. And if I apologize now, I don't expect to be forgiven. Bastard. Think you could just play it off like that, do ya? Even if he did put his friend out of the game, this is Yo. too much. Hey, you're going a bit rough on someone who's not even putting up a fight. Huh? Who's this joker? Oh, I'm just passing by. But I can't let this slide. Two against one's a little unfair, don't you think? Eh? Back off! This asshole hurt one of our players just so his team could get ahead. Oh, yeah? Well, I got some business with him. Maybe you two should take a hike. Shut up! Keep running your mouth and we'll take our anger out with you first. Alright. Uh, not worse than angry baseball fans. That guy thinks soccer fans are more violent. Ooh, healing vibration. Oh. That's too Chop. Heartless heckling? Was that? How dare you? Right. Just smack him. Oh, nice. nice. Rank four. Collapsing chair. Look at me go. Hammer swing. <laughs> Magical voice. I'm getting stronger. Oh, thumbtack scatters a mean one. <laughs> Shit. Who the hell is this guy? Yo. You all right? You're the baseball player, Anzai san right? Arigato. Yes, I don't know who you are, but you saved me. Thank you. My name's Kazuga, so you really are him. Ooh. Yeah, I am. But I won't be in baseball much longer. Glad I got a hold of you. I met a guy named Hanamiya. You might know him. Hmm? You met with Hanamiya? Yeah, he was looking for you. Wanted to ask you about that slide. Knowing him, he probably said I'd never do something like that. Right? Yeah. That's right. Hanamiya believes it wasn't your call to, call to make that play. Uh, of course he does. Mm. I thought it was strange myself, but seeing how you are acting earlier, it doesn't seem like he's wrong. I can't imagine someone who plays dirty like that just to lie down and take a beat of yep. Look, I don't know... I don't know all that Hanamiya told you, but I did that on my own will. Nobody ordered me to do it. Then, why do it? It's not like you had to pull a dangerous slide like that, right? <sighs> I panicked. Players do it all the time, especially in a game that could guarantee their team the season. Sure, but you're Hanamiya's friend, right? You won't want to put your friend out of the job just for a game. In the world of professional sports, it's all about winning or losing. You can't be saying something naive just because he's my friend. So leave it at that. The incident was entirely my doing. It's my fault. I plan on retiring. Is that enough? So did you. I really appreciate you to say back there. Take care. <sighs> I should tell Hanamiya what went down. Or head back. Hey, it's a sketchy guy. Alright. We met with Hanamiya. I'm ignoring this, ignoring that. I'm gonna beat these two and probably call a day. I got two side quests going on right now, and I accidentally triggered one and not the other. I went down the wrong street. Now, ah, well, things like that happen. I swear to God, that's another Tojo for press. I definitely gotta find where I turn this. You know what? Let's get some food real quick. We could use probably no healing, but still. Oh, this is gonna be some fancy dining. Irashimasu. All right, let's see. Oh, yeah, this is some sp Well, let's see how much this costs me. Immediately more than what I own. Hey, I'll, I'll eat later. Oh, wait, what's this? Man, another one. I am on a roll. All right. I want to travel over here to the park. You know what? I might have to walk there. Because there's places I haven't been yet. I'll trigger the taxis. I'm gonna walk there because I have to look. Look how you know I'll walk there after. I don't think you want to watch me walk slowly to places. Oh, no, is on. Alright, back to the kimchi. Nope. 
Nope, 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 nope. Not starting you. Not starting you. I'm walking by you. Oh, I need to use a dragon car. I could do that in episode two. That'd be fun. Really? He's just standing there. I'm beating him up. So late to it. Oh. I got this. Immediately, just this. Oh, it's so good. Flapsing chair. Check this out. Don't get caught. Okay. Here we go. Alright, he's up. Try this on the side. Here I go. Alright, I took Come care on. of him. Get ready with boss oh, hammer. Right. Alright, immediately thumbtacks. It's really good. I love it. Uh, let's do rolling thunder. I need that feed. Oh wow, that really hurt. I'll fight to the end. You seriously go away. I wouldn't underestimate you. You're gonna get Perfect. I feel the stats going up. <laughs> Windmill. That's a good nice. AOE. Get pumped. Yes. Magical. I did it. And ink blot nocturne. Okay. Oh. I got beehive, which probably you should never pick one of those off the ground. A mantis and this guy right here. This sucks. How am I supposed to rebuild my farm from scratch? Hey. Hey. You alright? Didn't hurt your leg or anything, did you? Huh? Oh, no. It's not like that. You see, I'm a sprinter on a track team, and I'm trying to improve my time. Huh. That's cool. Yeah, well, when I asked my coach for advice, he told me I should work on my form, or I'll never get better. But whenever I try to fix, to fix my posture, focus on breathing and all that, my time just gets worse and worse. I guess I just need to pick a style and run with it if you catch my drift. Wow. Sure, and hey, you'll get it eventually. Just keep putting in the work. You say that, but it feels like all this work is getting me nowhere. It's like I haven't made any progress at all. Hmm. Poor guy, as much as I want to help him, I just don't know the first thing about track. Not really sure what form he's talking about either. Hmm? Though, I do remember that businessman running pretty quick. Was it because he ate the kimchi? Yeah, that shit was real spicy. I kind of remember m running my ass off too. Hey, are you alright? Why'd you get all quiet? Oh, no reason. Maybe I should give him some of this killer kimchi. He could run as fast as he wants, probably straight to the bathroom. Still, <sighs> but if the kimchi's too hot, he might pass out later on. Should I just give it to him anyway? Yo! Hey, I got an idea. Try this. Huh? Try what? Kimchi? Yeah. There's a special pepper in it called the Devil's Claw. I think it might help you with your problem. I know. Okay, so now I'm confused. What does kimchi have to do with my running form? You'll find out. Just take a bite. I still know where you're getting at, but if you insist. Hmm, it's just a regular old kimchi. Oh, kind of spicy. Oh, wait, it burns! It burns! I'm not going to keep screaming it burns. You guys get it. Uh, how was it? It, it was perfect. <laughs> this is exactly what I've been waiting for. That run I just had was amazing. Oh, great. You found what you're looking for. Hi. Yep. As my mind succumbed to the searing heat and pain, I 
I could feel my ego dissolve. For a moment, it felt like I was falling through reality, and then I became God. If I keep this up, I'll share my record in no time, and then the national record's next. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad I could help. Yeah, you really did it. And to keep this kimchi infused god me alive, I'm going to keep Arigato running again. Things. I give you my thanks, Spice Bearer. Okay. Yeah, sure. Good luck with it. Just good luck. Huh. They think crazy kimchi actually had a use. Maybe I'll share some others. We could use a little. Okay. Oh, right. The old lady. I wonder if she has crossed the street yet. She can't still be struggling. Maybe I'll go check just in case. Alright. Right there. Alright, is there a taxi nearby? There is. Over there. Quickly, 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 quickly. You don't see me. Perfect. Alright, she's, I think, right over there. Oh, beautiful, I remember. Nice. Oh, sorry. Aw, oh, damn it, she's still trying to cross the street. After all this time, she still can't cross? Uh, oh, I know I can do it. Somehow. Ma'am, are you still having trouble? Hmm? Oh, you're that young fella. Here's my dilemma. I can almost make it, but then the light starts flashing and I get cold feet. <sighs> Back in my heyday, I was the star of the track team. Quick foot Ume, that's what they called me. <laughs> How many decades ago was that? But now I'm just an old fossil who can't even cross the street. Oh, if only these legs still worked. Now I get where she's coming from. In her heart, she's still a star athlete. I bet this kimchi could give her the kick she needs. Maybe I should offer her some right before the signal changes. Granny, try putting a little of this in your mouth before the signal changes. Oh, now what is this? That's not kimchi, is it? It is. And I know it may sound bonkers, but this stuff will light a fire under your ass, no doubt. Ugh. Truthfully? I've got half a mind to shoo you away for suggesting I engage in such nonsense. But I've seen what a kind person you are. You're honest to a fault. And I do know you mean well. I'll trust you, young man. Awesome. Finally crossed the street. That was sick, Granny. <laughs> I'm either crying from joy or how spicy that was. Either way, I could finally relive my glory days, and it's all thanks to you and that kimchi. But goodness, that was fiery stuff. Nearly burned me to ashes mid-run. <laughs> no, uh, I'm just glad you're all right. I'd say I'm more than just all right. I feel light and limber like never before. Where might I find more of this miraculous kimchi? Oh, uh, an older guy on Sakura Alley sells it. He might still be around. Is that right? I ought to spread word around the neighborhood association. Uh, make sure you warn everybody. I will certainly try. In any case, see you around. Well, bye, Granny. Good job, Granny. Glad it all worked out.
I'm thinking that kimchi seller might want to know about what happened. All right, back to the street. Share the good news with the kimchi vendor. He's down the second one. with the mob all of a sudden. One order of Miracle Kimchi, please. Me too. Me three. Me four. Whoa, what the crap? He's swamped with customers now. Oh, you're the young man from last time. As you can see, my business took off out of nowhere. I'm raking it in right now. Yeah? Good to hear, man. But I'm puzzled as to how my kimchi suddenly got so popular. People keep asking whether it helps with running or romance. Would you know anything about that? <laughs> uh, good question. The important thing is, business is looking good. And I know people like the flavor, so I'm sure they'll be back for more. I sure hope you're right. Can I get some kimchi, please? Oops. <laughs> I guess I'll get out of your way. I want to hold up the line. Well, I encourage you to stop by again. I'll sell you kimchi anytime. Ooh, you're the gentleman from earlier. Hey there, lady from the crosswalk. Remember that kimchi you gave me? I went ahead and splurged on a huge batch. He gave me some extra as a bonus for buying so much. So would you care to join me? Ooh, sounds good. No mind if I do. It Miracle of Spice. And now you can buy one a oh, really good item. Oh wait, Umiko. Oh. Nice. So now you can buy kimchi by the way. Uh basically, uh if you eat it you get an extra turn in battle. It's really good for that. If you want an extra turn in battle, you eat the kimchi. They can act twice, if I remember correctly. I could always remember wrong. Alright, let's finish the baseball quest, and then uh, I think I'll call it there. And honestly, I don't think I need to do any off-screen uh, grinding right now. I love that decently. Also, wait one second. When do you get that skill, Adachi? Oh, no. Not, no, no, not what I wanted. There we go. Adachi, when do you get that one skill? Hammer swing, healthy routine, boss hammer, master hammer. I don't know. Maybe he already has it. Oh no, there's business been coming towards me. You're gonna be some of the burnout bullies. A windmill. Right. It's a really good AOE. Oh, hi, bud. How you doing? Hey. Yo, how's it going? How's it going? Did you meet with? Anzai? Mm. Yeah, I did. But well, he was persistent about being his fault. <sighs> was he? But he, but he was just like you said. I can see why you believe him. Thank you, Kazuko-san. Still, we're at an impasse as long as he keeps quiet. Ooh. Hey, you two. Who are you? Name's Kudo. I'm a journalist. You're Kazuko-san, right? Mm? We know each other? I saw how you helped Hanamiya. Kinda of embarrassed to say, but I sort of followed you. What for? Looked 
looked like you and Hanamiya were really hitting it off. Figured you'd make a move on that slide incident. Even saw you meet with Anzai. What's your angle? Don't get me wrong. I want to help you two. Help us. I'll get right to the point. I've got inside info. The Shark Star's manager. Really? He had a nasty rumor going around about him for a while. Nobody would dare say it out loud. Everyone knows that he's behind what happened. He's even been seen threatening Anzai here and there. No, not that. What? So Anzai gets all the bad press while that jerk gets off scot-free? He's got connections all over town. Not to mention money and power. Silencing bad publicity is all in the day's work. There was a reporter doing some digging on all his wrongdoings not too long ago. Apparently both he and his publisher went missing. The press couldn't write about this guy even if they wanted to. <laughs> Hmm. If they want to, huh? Some journalists. My thoughts exactly. It's why I'm bringing this information to you. And that information is? I was able to find the manager's favorite spot. Some place called Rose Blossom. He comes in from the back entrance. Usually pretty hush-hush. Wow. Ah, and if we go there, we might find Ooh. this guy. Yeah, you might be able to uncover the truth. I intend to do the same and get some evidence. Evidence? We can't put a story out without solid evidence. But if we can get some dirt on him, something he can't talk his way out of, we have him cornered. For that, we need to get him and his guards down. Going in by, by myself is too reckless. However so, I'd like to ask for your help. I see where you're getting at. I'm Hold in. on. Hold up. That's way too risky. You screw up, and you'll be thrown out of the game for good. Then someone's bound to recognize you. But I, I'll go. That'll work, yeah. Arigato na. Yeah. Thanks. Head the rose blossom when you're ready. We'll meet out in front. Yo. Hey, hold on. Kudo-san. Mm -hmm. What is it? Why suddenly take a risk like this? You'll be in serious trouble if shit hits the fan. Won't you? I guess seeing you go the distance for a complete stranger made me feel shamed for putting out so much crap all these years. I'm a journalist. Words are what I do. If I'm not using that power to put a-holes like him in their place, then what's the point? <laughs> Plus, I'm a fan of Anzai. Watching him play ball inspired me to chase my dreams. The least I could do is try and get back. <laughs> Pretty passionate guy. I thought all reporters were full of shit, but I guess there's some good ones out there too. Yeah, sorry you got mixed up in all this. I'm counting on you, Kazuka-san. Leave it to me. Leave it to me. That asshole won't know what hit him. I'm meeting Kudo at Rose Blossom. I'll head over there when I'm ready. Uh, I'm basically ready now. Rose Blossom is over here. Yes. All right, time to take a taxi. Get out of my way! And get off your phone! Oh, damn, she dodged. Alright, going to the right over here. Alright, we're here. Oh. You're here. Manager just okay. arrived. Perfect. All, all right. Let's do this. All right, guys. Cheers to the Shark Star's big win. Cheers. All right. Nah. Hey, Mr. Manager. Drinks are on you today, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, that's how it is. Well, we did win. Sure, drink all you want. <sighs> so, that's Anzai, Manager. <laughs> Talk about a win, man. It was so close. Not often we get a, such a tight game. R really, it's all thanks to Hanamiya getting decked like that. Huh. No kidding. Hanamiya's the one that got hurt, right? That Anzai took out. It's all off the news. <sighs> you know, Anzai was... My kind of guy, too. Shame he turned out to be such a creep. I'll say a couple choice words for, for Manager here, and he's flat out 
Holy cow. A couple choice words from manager here. And he flat out downs another player. Ain't that right? What? Eh? <gasps> what? Did you tell him to slide, Mr. Manager? Mm -hmm. Hell no. I didn't. I just gave him a... Gave it to him plain and simple. All I said was we would have been able to win with Hanamiya out in the pit win with the pitcher. Told him if he was loyal, he'd take care of it. That's all. <laughs> oh, you're a bad boy. Anzai's, uh, Anzai became a baseball player after manager picked him up. There's no way he'd disobey someone he owes so much. <laughs> Still good thinking. You're really playing to win. <laughs> Gotta keep a good handle on those who owe you. He did well. We get our big win while he takes the big fall. <laughs> Figure since he's out of the game, I'll at least give him some referrals for whatever he ends up. <laughs> Very kind Yo. of you. Appreciate you clearing that up, boys. Mm -hmm. Who are you? I'm your local journalist, Kudo, and I've just recorded everything you said. Eh? What? We've got proof you're behind all this foul play. Once we get this over to the press, you're finished. <laughs> if you make it to them in one piece, maybe. Who do you think you're dealing with? Uh, uh -huh. don't underestimate me. You can't just stay manager if you don't learn how to play the game. Stand back, Kudo-san. But you said you were good with words, right? Well, this is what I'm good at. Matter of fact, I'm just the guy for the job. Leave it to me. Right, good luck. Ooh. Boys, I want these idiots and their precious evidence gone. <laughs> Fine by me, let's take it out in front. I'll take on the whole damn team. I'm gonna s I'm gonna windmill all of you. you get out of trouble now. Scared? Right. Thumbtack scan. I'm not bad. Oh god damn that was good. Yeah. Right. Ready now. I got this. Oh. Oh. That was something. Pain in the ass. You're gonna get it. Yeah, she is literally the strongest cool. person in my party. It's hilarious. Here we go. Come on. Huda, let's go. Take your best shot. Demon Slash is a hard one for me, but I'll get it one day. Right. Go. I'm Do your really good move. Not enough. Yeah. Alright, we whoop butt. <clears throat> Man, the hell you got? Arigato, no. Thanks, you really saved my ass. Don't sweat it. Anyway, you better get on with that article, yeah? So. Yeah. For the first time in a long time, I'll finally be able to write something worth reading. Anzai will be able to return to baseball with this. This is for helping me with our little interview. Take it. You got old fountain pen, which is actually really good for Aerie. Give my regards to Hanamiya and Anza. Yeah. Sure. That's a relief. Now, Anzai can make his return. Better let him know. One second. Oh, too soon. There we go. Gear. Harry. Get rid of that binding. You're getting... Wait. Oh, damn. I thought the pen was her thing. One second. Pen might be a different class. Shame. Okay. Oh, agility. Nice. Alright. So, not yet. I thought that was Ares, but I guess not. Alright. Alright, let's go back and uh, tell them the good news. Uh, where are they? Okay, up here. Let's take a taxi, then we'll end it. Good stuff. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Hey, we have 67,000. We're getting money back. Nice. Hey, 
That's some good news for you. Yo. Hey, you're that guy from before. Your manager admitted to everything. Huh? It'll be out to the public soon, and then you'll finally be able to put this all behind you. You can get back to playing baseball again. Pretty cool, huh? <sighs> no. That was still my fault. I have no intention of returning to the field. Damn. You gotta be so stubborn. <sighs> sure. My manager may have given me the order. But in the end, I'm still the one that went through with it. <laughs> no matter what my manager said, if I hadn't done it, none of this would have happened. <sighs> you don't understand. Baseball is sacred. And I ended up betraying it. Whatever the world says, I don't have any right to play the game ever again. <sighs> Not after putting Hanayama out of the game like that. <sighs> I've been saying his wrong name. It's Hanamaya. Hanamaya. I've been calling Hanamiya. Whoops. <laughs> My bad. Hey, hey. Don't act like I'm down and out just yet. Huh? Hanayama. <laughs> Hanamiya. Still stubborn <laughs> as hell, eh, Anzai? Oh my god. Hanayama. Hanayama. I'm so sorry. Anzai. No! I gotta say this. I took away baseball from you. Even knowing how much you loved it. I am truly, terribly sorry. Like I just said, don't talk about me like I'm out for good. It's not over for me yet. You haven't taken anything from me. <laughs> huh? I can't say this doesn't hurt. But I'll recover. And I'll make my triumphant return. Just watch. The fans will be sad if I don't. And what's worse, my good friend will just stay depressed. Oh my god. Hanayama. Whether you come back or not, that's up to you to decide. Either way, just keep this in mind. When I step back out on the field, it won't be the same game if you're not in it. <sighs> Hanayama. You're not gonna make it up to me by moping around, are you? If you want to make it right, then do it on the diamond. We're baseball guys, aren't we? <laughs> Come on, Anzai, don't worry about it. Why don't we give it another crack? We'll climb back up together. Why? Why would you ever be willing to forgive someone like me? Well, that's what friends do, right? <sighs> Hanayama. Hey. Thank you. <laughs> oh, good thing there's no crime in baseball. <laughs> All run heroism completed. Hanyama can uh, join my uh, sweep. Maybe I'll hire him one day, but until then, I think I went on way bored long enough. Who boy, let me tell you, it's gone for a while. But until then, I'll see you next time. I'll probably finish off the side quests, so expect that. Yeah, I think next time I'll still finish up side quests. There's still a couple around the map, and that'll probably be a good hour or so. So until next time, I'll see you later, and bye.